Well, an Oklahoma City man receiving calls threatening to have him, his family, and his friends beheaded, all because of his Muslim faith. Threats like that are sparking fear for some Oklahoma families who now say they are terrified to reveal that they're Muslims. News Channel 4's Leslie Rangel joins us in the studio. And Leslie, Oklahoma Muslim families say they are so scared that they are nearly in hiding. This is just hard to believe. It's a high security alert, and even Muslim schools across the state are not allowing children to go outside to play during. It's a lockdown situation for Oklahoma Muslims that stems from comments made by John Bennett, the head of the Republican Party here in Oklahoma. Here at the Islamic Society of Greater Oklahoma, it's heightened alert for the men attending afternoon prayer. We have uh, no problem uh, with people expressing their concerns about our faith. But when it crosses the line um, and uh, Representative Bennett would make a statement such as Islam is a cancer in American society then it, that, that needs to be eliminated, we take that very seriously. The comments were made earlier this week in Salisaw. We take no chances. Um, yesterday, our children did not go play outside in the entire state of Oklahoma. They're afraid to send their kids to school. They're afraid um, to be seen in public, especially women who wear headscarf. These are members of CARE, an organization that tries to enhance the understanding of Islam. Today, as they were making signs for an event, a threatening call came in. I got a phone call from a man who uh, asked if this was care, yes, asked if I was a director. I said yes and said, well, I think you should be beheaded and I think all Muslims should be beheaded. And I, I just, I'm shocked. Shock and fear that trickles down to his family. Do you have children? I do. I have a two-year-old son. I still worry that my son is going to grow up and face uh, ridicule, face bullying, and face challenges uh, because of his faith. A faith these believers say is tainted by a minority of radicals and an elected official speaking out against their faith. He claims to be a Christian, so um, act like Jesus. Uh, the way he's acting is really contrary to the Jesus I know. Now, we did try to reach Representative Bennett at his multiple offices. So far, he has not returned our phone calls. There is a peaceful rally planned tomorrow at Penn Square Mall beginning at 4. It's led by the Oklahoma Muslims Against ISIS.